After over a decade of stops and starts, offshore wind is finally gearing up in the U.S. It offers a promise of an emissions-free energy source. Despite Europe harnessing the power of offshore wind turbines for over 30 years, the U.S. has yet to build its own big wind farm. That's changing with two projects under construction off the coast of New York and Massachusetts, with a whole pack of other projects coming soon. President Biden has set a goal to build enough wind farms to power 10 million homes by 2030, and developers will spend more than $60 billion to build wind farms in U.S. waters by 2025, according to BNF estimates. A giant drill marks the South Fork Wind Farm in the Hamptons, where an underground cable will come ashore right past the $45 million mansion featured in the HBO show Succession. A tunnel that's dug under the beach for the cable will travel 35 miles offshore to 12 turbines, each almost as tall as the Eiffel Tower. And the even bigger Vineyard Wind Project is also prepping work in Massachusetts, with 62 turbines that will produce enough power for 400,000 homes. Both those projects are scheduled to start producing electricity in 2023. It's not every day we see a whole new power source built from scratch here in the U.S., but that's what's happening right now. Over the next few years, beachgoers in the Northeast might even catch a glimpse of the turbines spinning out on the horizon.